emergency responders in Martin County are in a fight to get the county's only, only medical helicopter back in the air. John Zanitas is in Stewart, where LifeStar has been grounded for the past six months. This is where Martin County paramedics and firefighters had their rescue helicopter. But for six months, this hangar has stood empty. And first responders say that is way too long. When lives are on the line, every second counts. Any delay is significant. Since January, Martin County firefighters and paramedics have been without a critical tool, their own trauma chopper. It's a concern on every trauma call that I go on. Late last year, the company that was providing the trauma chopper terminated their contract. Ever since, the county has been negotiating with a new company. But six months have gone by, still no chopper. The public may not be aware that they've been without a trauma chopper. The county has been able to borrow Palm Beach County or St. Lucie County's helicopter, and so far, the county says there haven't been any issues. As of this conversation, no complaints and no incidents that we've been aware of that have been uh, negative. But the Martin County Firefighters Association says it's just a matter of time before they have a life threatening situation on their hands and the other county's helicopters aren't available. Could happen today, could happen tomorrow, could happen next week. Don't know when it's going to happen, but it'll, it will happen. The county told me they are confident that they'll be able to wrap up these negotiations sometime soon. But as far as an exact date, an exact timeline, they told me they do not know at this point. In Martin County, John's Needus, WPBF 25 News.